Hi, I'm Tim Alatori, Chief Operating Officer and Co-Founder of Orbital Assembly Corporation. And I'm standing in front of the display of Skylab here at the U.S. Space and Rocket Center. And behind me to the left is one of the largest surviving pieces of Skylab that survive re-entry. It's a pressure tank for oxygen. It's one of six tanks on the station. And while Skylab's useful life was only a couple of days, the company that made this tank, General Dynamics, is still making these exact same pressure tanks today. And one of the exciting things that's happened in space over the last number of decades is that starting with Skylab to International Space Station to the programs that are happening right now, there are vendors that have developed technology over decades that is now available for commercial off-the-shelf use. And that is making it possible for Orbital Assembly Corporation to build the largest space stations with the most capabilities that have ever been seen. If you would like to be a part of what we're doing, click the links below and learn how you can be a part of this exciting adventure.